WTFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome all to another wonderful update at 2 p.m. here at TFNN with me. That's David White. So what do we have right now? Well, we certainly have a market that uh, I think is doing what uh, we talked about last week, which is stumbling up. Uh, it'll have fits and starts throughout the week. But uh, fund buying really begins on Wednesday in earnest. Normally, um, why they can start buying now for funds, they generally want to uh, make sure and jack the price up uh, before those funds buy. So, well, you know, we're, we, I, I like to think that we have the markup phase, which really kind of started on Friday a little bit. Uh, the next couple of days will be uh, the markup. Uh, and then they'll uh, distribute uh, as much stock into the 401k folk that have to buy or anybody buying funds. And that runs through pretty much on Friday. Uh, we'll have it. So you've got to have a pretty compelling case that this is the week that the market's going to drop the chalupa. Uh, but it is problematic. Things we're going to talk about on the show today. Uh, Mike, uh, McDonald's is uh, uh, selling Krispy Kreme donuts. McDonald's hadn't done anything in a long time to make me think that more people wanted to go there. But I bet they do. I used home sales this morning, kind of popped the market a bit. Uh, everybody's trying to get in uh, before the interest rates go even higher. Uh, Mr. Buffett is out slamming many people uh, after a weekend when the president, Bernie Sanders, and some of the other uh, usual folk are complaining about and or trying to get rid of uh, share buybacks. Uh, Buffett uh, basically called them financial illiterates, which is uh, pretty, pretty uh, that's the fighting words for uh, Mr. Buffett. Uh, Tesla has had a good pop today on uh, numbers out of its uh, out of its uh, Germany factory, making about 4,000 cars a month. After the bell tonight, we've got Oxy and Workday. After the bell, see it. The reality.